A vigil will be held to honor the life of one of two teenagers found murdered along a wooded trail in Orange County. The bodies of 18-year-old Devin Clark and 14-year-old Lyric Woods were found over the weekend. Police have identified a person of interest, but have yet to make an arrest. Elena Athens joins us live now with more on this case. Elena, good afternoon. Yeah, the sheriff, uh, Barbara, telling me there's no new information to report, but that his office is methodically working towards the arrest of that 17 year old suspect. Uh, we did just get in the 911 call that was placed when the bodies were discovered. It's, there's a there's a power, there's a like a mm -hmm. an, there's an access to like where the power company cut a road in. Mm -hmm. And they're, they're just laying around on the side of the road. We came home, we were on a, on a four-wheeler, mm -hmm. and we were, we were actually putting out deer corn, and we discovered them. The victims were found with what appeared to be gunshot wounds. The slain teens are going to be honored tonight at two separate events. Lyric Woods played volleyball on a travel league and just started ninth grade at Cedar Ridge High School when she was killed. A home volleyball game tonight against Person High will be played in her memory. Around that same time, family and friends of Devin Clark will be gathering in Yanceyville. There will be a vigil. The 18-year-old's mom is asking people to bring candles. A balloon release will follow, and they'll be using his favorite colors, blue and and black. The community is offering support to both families right now in another way. Donations flowing in for online fundraisers to pay for funeral expenses. Uh, I checked the accounts about an hour ago. The one for Woods exceeding its goal and raising more than $23,000. The fundraiser for Clark doubling its goal and bringing in more than 24 grand. We know both families are desperate to learn who is responsible for these murders and they want justice. Uh, the Orange County District Attorney's Office says they do not know yet uh, if they're going to be charging this teen as an adult. They're going to wait until there's an arrest to make that call. We're live in Orange County, Elena Athens, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.